that's, that's my joke. I can't say the other word. X <laughs> in word. Yeah, yeah. That's my dude, man. I, I talked to the. I like John. John is. Yeah. Yeah, I just put something out there. He's a real humble guy, man. He is. I, I respect him a lot, but uh, I talk to him often, you know what I mean? That's good. Um, who, else, who else you talk to? I mean, as far as. Yeah, so, um, that's David, positive for the baby. Positive, uh, yeah. Like Aaron, Mbajua. That's, um, that's another guy. Yeah, yeah. That's. Um, uh, what about Jeremiah? That's Jeremiah another, Shaw. Uh, Jeremiah is doing a lot of things, man. That's another thing that was that was like, man, this guy, he he put his back on the line for Jig. It's like mm -hmm. nobody's really showing up. Like he, like Thursday. I owe him a visit on Thursday, yeah. my, personally. Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's getting a lot of people in there now. I came to the Tuesday yeah. spot and I have for him. I got I have to make it up to the Thursday, and I will. Jeremiah Shaw, like I said, I'm Big Shaw. Shaw. Yeah, that's that's another guy right there. He he, he showed up, man. Yeah. He, it's not about the money. It's, 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 it's the love. It's the love. It's, it's what he loves. It's like his beats. It's, it's crazy. Oh, you mean his own? His personal? His personal, his personal music. He sends me a lot of it. It's, I feel like, man. Get that out there. Now, nah, here we have here. Here we go. Introduce your daughter. We have Brielle right here. Jazzy Bree. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's my wonder twin right here. I don't know, this is how we used to battle. Somebody just come right in your face and just start. Your turn. You got to move? You got to move for me? Huh? No? Maybe later? That's cool. Uh, so, one more question. Being a creative person, you see JIT the way it is now, the, the, the culture. And again, I am Mr. No Edit. I am unbiased in this. This is just a question. But uh, I know you would like to see Jitten uh, worldwide, is what I'm guessing. Worldwide, people want to learn it. Can you tell me what the culture needs to get from A to B? What is your opinion on what's needed? Uh, because that is your goal, your dream, right? Uh, the way I see it is, it's more like, don't get me wrong, but the competitiveness and uh, all that stuff is, is, is much needed, you know what I'm saying, to keep us on our toes. You know that's, that's just what we do, you know what I'm saying, inside of our city. But at the same time, we need a, a community that's go work together, not just here and there. You know? <laughs> Not just here and there, you know what I mean? We need to get a set plan get, and actually act on it. Not just, okay, let's get it together. We need, a, we need, a, we need an actual concrete yeah. plan. Yeah, we need a concrete plan and act on it. Let's go, let's do it. That's, all, that's what we need. We need some actual some people that's actually into it and not just for the money. You know I mean? If you're in it for the money, you you're in it for the wrong reason. It's not about money, because you got people that's that's been doing this thing for some years, you know what I'm saying? They're not worried about the money, you know what I mean? But you would be coming into the gym, you know what I'm saying? And all you worried about is money, that's the wrong way to go. We, we, we do this for the love. You do it for the love, and money will come. Don't worry about that. You gotta take it to that level where humble yourself, I'm gonna do this. Do, do you, um, last question, do you have any suggestions for the show. Being that you have these multiple ideas, you got you got ideas just seeping from your pores. Right? Take what, what, what? Take to the streets. Take to the streets. That was another idea I had. Uh, you mean you mean take my camera, go upstairs and out in the streets and just grab random people? Yeah. So, so like um, I, 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 like you, like interviewing me right now. Talk to him. Like, okay, how do I feel? I'm not racist. I'm just respect to white people. You're not racist. I, I'm not. But You're not racist. We have a lot of white people downtown. Man, take the camera. Take these people. Go out there and talk to these people. And they don't know about you. You interview the people who don't know about about you, right? Talk to people who don't know about it. Take your interview to go right now. You know, I'm not about you. Yeah. What I ask him? 
So, like, I'll say that one question was, uh, do you know anything about jig? No. You got a person that actually know how to jig. You give me a show. Okay. Yeah, you show them. You know what I'm saying? What? Maybe they be willing to learn, and maybe not. You know what I mean? Maybe they can pass it on. But if you get a, a crowd of people that's going to be interested in what it is, you know, yeah. investor, whatever the case may be, it's just trying to get it out there. It's not just. I, I know this, and again, this is coming from an unbiased position. Mm -hmm. I know this that a lot of younger dancers like yourself are really concerned with. Pushing Jill past Detroit. It's like it's, it's the number one thing. And, and and my question as an older person is, and this may be a silly question to you or someone else, but it's just a, it's a question uh, that I think needs an answer. People can hear the answer. Why? Why is it so important to everyone that Jit leaves Detroit? And move out to other places. Well, for me, um, you got these crazy dances, the nene, the whip, they nationwide. You got these crazy dances that's that's going nationwide, but you got an actual dance and don't nobody know about it. I mean, it's not even so much about everybody learning how to do it; just more so everybody seeing it, getting that respect. So it's like a respect thing. Yeah, you got your own city, don't even. The only worry about is the name. They don't care about you. Know? Mm. That's that's the thing right there. Because you have so much passion for it, it's like you want to see more out of what you do. And now, is there anything else you want to say or talk about uh, real quick that I didn't bring up or something you would like? To? I forgot. Man. I don't even uh, I just want to. No, I don't know. No. You don't have to force it. I got you, know, it. you can always come back, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to do Open another Open the door for us. We told you that. We talked about the what's on your mind. Yeah. Uh, talked about some ideas. Yeah. I could say this one thing. Uh, I do want to apologize about a situation that happened between me, me and a group, couple group members or whatnot. Your group members? Yeah. Group what? Yeah, it was in the page. Oh, hold on. This is an exclusive. Exclusive, yeah. Continue. Um, I just want to apologize because this shouldn't have happened like that. Whatever happened in, in between our group is in between our group, but um, I'm not sure what the problem is, but we definitely need to talk because we are a group. It's, it's 10 years, you know, and we need to move forward past whatever the, the situation may be. I still love y'all. Y'all still my girls, like I tell you. Now, this was a surprise. You didn't talk to me about this, right? No, I, didn't. I just want the viewers to know. Yeah. This is this is sincere from the heart. Yeah, it is. But this is the place to do it. No edit. I, mean, I can't change nothing. I, honestly, I mean, because uh, I've been hearing, uh, like, honestly, I've had maybe three or four people come to me. What's up with you and your girl? I'm like, I don't know. It's like this person telling me this person don't like me, this person telling me like it, it, it bothers me because for me to look at you all as my brother and I got other people coming to talk to me about what's going on with my brain. I don't go out like that, so it shouldn't be nobody asking me anything. So that was a problem with me. Well, I'll say this, you know, as a, a guy that's um, been in groups for years. You know, just uh, just just call, them. call them. each and every one of them, one by one, and y'all settle that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all be like, you sick? Y'all be asking too long, too long. Squash it, whatever the problem is, man. It ain't never that big. Yeah, So this is uh, Mr. No Edit signing out. This is the first time I got to sign out on the show too. Signing out. Signing out. Now my man L1, if he wants. And his daughter, I don't know if she's going to battle me. She ain't, I've been shooting moves all night. She ain't shooting no moves yet. But uh, you want to do a little something or not? Yeah. You do not have to. You do not have to. That music sounds good. Did you like that song right there? I got to. You like that one? You feeling that one? Time, that's called Timeline. You want that one? Come on, I got you. Mike.
read that timeline of law. I mean, I just just mix it up. Gonna bug. Just mix it up. Just mix it up. You're gonna do this timeline, whatever, whatever you want. Right, right. Yeah. Teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Here we come. And give me a little for you. No, 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 you're on the carpet. We got you in here with the big dogs. Ron. No, you want, huh? Ron, uh, Ron right here. Did y'all need some barbecue? You want some barbecue? No, barbecue. A barbecue? No, no, he about to dance. Okay. Mickey, you want to dance? Mm-hmm. <laughs> here we go. Here's my man about to get down. Keith, don't. Coach Keith. Yeah, we want to get down for us. You can go wherever you want to go. You can go in between them if you want. What you got, L1? Joe, take notes. Yeah, one one by the, by the, by the water here. Nice. Come on, baby girl, come on up there. 